strangers are better still our curse. It's cool in many ways to be Canadian. We won't say that we're better, it's just that we're less worse. G'day viewers. So welcome to Canada part two. Um, we have now moved on to Vancouver for the Vancouver International Swordplay Symposium, or this, um, which was an absolutely superb event. Um, Academy Duello have a fan fantastic premises. I'm almost insanely jealous when I go there. Um, they're a fantastic bunch of people. Uh, the conference was sold out, super well attended with people from all over North America and Europe and the UK and even another Australian. Um, a really interesting bunch of mix of classes as well um, and I was there obviously to do the English thing. So the theme of the weekend was this versus that. Um, so I was specifically doing silver as a contrast to the Italian side sword, the Bolognese. Um, at the Saturday night gala, uh, which is great fun, and I got to open a bottle of champagne with a saber, which was fun. Um, but I was also asked to do the demonstration bout between Silver and Rob Rutherford of the Chicago Swordplay Guild, representing the Italians. Um, so the interesting thing about this one is really, I think it, it demonstrates one of the reasons why Silver is against you extending your sword forward towards your opponent. Um, not only does it give them access to your blade, um, but it also presents this arm as an extended target. Um, so I didn't make any actions on Rob's blade. I'd been to his classes. I knew exactly what fate would await me should I attempt to beat that thing out of the way. Um, and uh, But as you'll see, um, it is a good demonstration of why extending that arm in front of you makes it vulnerable. Representing the sword in one hand, cut and thrust traditions of both England and Italy are Rob Rutherford and Paul Wagner. Yeah. Now, we put a time up for three minutes so you can fight as many passes as you like within that time, and we'll call time as you like. Uh, when we call time, you may conclude the pass that you already knew of. Thank you. 